Hi guys, how are you? As Andy McReynolds is welcoming his first customers of the day. Well, good to see you guys. Thanks for coming out. I appreciate appreciate the support. He's preparing to welcome his last. Flaxons is closing its doors after almost 30 years of business in Altoona. It's been uh, it's been a great a great time, but it's time to take a step back. Right this way. McReynolds has been serving family recipes made from scratch. My mom's banana pie. That's probably number one. For nearly half his life. The cup of chili though goes to B2. It's why many customers have turned into regulars at his restaurant. The food is really good. Other food, it's so good. Thanks for coming out, thank you. Saying goodbye won't be easy. Customers say the good flavors came with good company and good memories. Well, you actually came here for my 21st birthday. We just moved here from West Virginia last year. It's been a nice comfort. McReynolds says his phone has been busy with customers itching to get one last bite. The well wishes have been uh, something that I did not expect. So um, it's very touching and appreciated and uh, humbling. Claxons has been serving up big flavors since 1996, and now the owner wants to give back to the employees who have been serving customers for all those years. I'm really proud of them, and it's the least we could do. All of the restaurant's net sales will be going to employees to help them as they search for their next job. The building was sold to a new local restaurant, but McReynolds says the business itself was not sold. He says his kids could reopen Claxons one day if they wanted to. McReynolds says he'll be at the restaurant as much as he can this final week. I'll stay so busy, I hopefully won't have time to get too choked up about it. To personally thank the people who have helped his business survive and thrive for nearly three decades. In Altoona, Ophelia Jacobson, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader. That restaurant will be missed. McReynolds says people will know what new restaurant will take over his space by early next week.